right, so what's going on everyone? Welcome to Workshop. Uh, today I wanna to talk about how you can tune your BMW using Wi-Fi. So if you wanted to tune your 335 or 135 or whatever uh, prior, you would need one of these uh, or a JB4. But if you wanted to flash tune it with MHD or Boot Mod 3, you would need one of these K uh, DCAM cables, I believe they're called. Uh, now this is a Bimmer Geeks Pro cable. This is like a $45 cable. And uh, the way it works is you plug this end into your OBD2 port and this end into your uh, Android device that you're using to tune the car. And that worked fine. The Bimmer Geeks cable is actually faster than most of the other uh, K plus DCAN cables on the market. So that's why I bought it. But that's not what this video is about. Uh, today I'm going to show you how you can use just this small little MHD tuning uh, Wi-Fi adapter to tune your car or data log it or read your codes or whatever. So this little thing came out about a month ago. Um, MHD released it uh, across a couple vendors and it does everything that these old cables do uh, but it does it through a Wi-Fi connection with your Android device. So that's really cool because you no longer have a cable running through your interior or uh, if you're like me and you mount your phone in the center console, my uh, cable would run over my steering column and I would actually kick it sometimes when I was uh, shifting. But MHD's Wi-Fi adapter removes any need for a cable, uh, so it's pretty useful uh, if you're trying to tune or data log because you have no cables running around. But beyond that, it's faster than the cable because it's newer technology and I don't know the ins and outs of it, but apparently the tech that's used in these cables is like 10 or 20 years old and uh, Wi-Fi data transfer is much newer and faster. So I'm gonna show you guys just how to do that in this video. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is take your MHD Wi-Fi adapter and plug it into the OBD2 port in your car. So that's down here if you have 335 and 135, and I think all BMWs, it should be right here under a little plastic panel that I took off. So after you plug it in there, you'll wanna go over to your phone, open that up, and then I'll actually just screen record everything I do on the phone to make it a little bit better looking. Once you're on your phone, you're just going to want to go to the settings and go to your Wi-Fi connections. Oops, that's Bluetooth. Go to your Wi-Fi connections and you'll see actually that there is a MHD Wi-Fi network. And uh, if you go on that, you'll be connected with your Wi-Fi adapter. So once you've connected to the Wi-Fi adapter in your settings, go to your MHD app. It'll open up and mine actually automatically goes to the monitors. And as you can see, uh, it's live monitoring through no cable at all. I mean, look here, you have no cable plugged into the phone. And down here you have the Wi-Fi adapter uh, in the OBD2 port. So. Uh, that's how it works. I'm actually gonna tune the car too real quick. I'll just show you how fast it can tune um, Using Wi-Fi. It's pretty impressive So for that I'm actually gonna turn the car off Take the key put it back in the ignition and turn the ignition on and then I'm gonna flash my custom map From motive Shout out to Chris and Jake at Motive for making a really good custom tune. So this is just a map switch. It's usually really, really quick, but the Wi-Fi adapter makes it even quicker. All you do here is just click the map right, and it's gonna do all of its stuff. And as you can see, it just says 30 seconds left, 25 seconds left. And you can compare this to your own flash times. This is a lot faster than it was with the cable. So 
So the tune is done. All I have to do is just turn off the ignition and wait. And that's as easy as it gets, really. All right, so the tune is done. I'm gonna start the car right now to show you that it worked. And as you can see, uh, that's how you flash your car with Wi-Fi. So something I forgot to note is that the cables cost about $45, the pro cable, which I'll link in the description as well as everything else. Uh, the Wi-Fi adapter is about $70 or $80, and uh, that is a price difference. So if you're trying to be budget friendly, uh, maybe the Wi-Fi adapter isn't the go-to because this pro cable is pretty close to how fast the Wi-Fi adapter is. Uh, if you want to save even more money, there are much cheaper cables that go for about $15. Um, if I find one of those from a decent vendor, I'll link that as well. Uh, I used it on my 5 Series that I had before this car, but um, those are pretty slow and uh, I don't really trust them anymore. So yeah, if you're looking for a good solution that's clean and can flash your car very quickly, the Wi-Fi adapter is the way to go. It just costs more money. Uh, but if you're willing to pay for it, it's definitely worth it if what you're looking for is um, a clean setup that's faster than a cable. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you liked this video. I hope it showed you uh, how cool the MHD Wi-Fi adapter is. And uh, yeah, see you guys in the next one.